everyone, my name is Father Josh Barrett. I'm the priest here at Church of the Redeemer and also priest associate over in Corning. Today we celebrate and remember Phoebe, a deacon in the church and an early friend, companion, and fellow preacher with Paul, the Apostle Paul. Like these early figures in Christianity, we don't know a ton about them, but Phoebe is someone that sticks out as one of these female companions and early leaders in the church. Other women like Lydia and Chloe and Nymphia and Junita, the apostle, who was named um, among the apostles, a female apostle. So uh, these are early examples of leaders in the church. And this is why that we give attention to these female leaders in the church, because it is also their witness that bears witness to the full beauty and the full majesty of the gospel going to all people, all places, male and female. Phoebe is known and mentioned once in the book of Acts as a deacon. She might have walked around with Paul around the empire of proclaiming with him. We often think that Paul went around preaching by himself, which isn't true. Um, like any of us, this work of following Jesus takes a group of people and it can never be done alone. So Paul had Phoebe, as he names, as someone he trusted. And so he might have carried the letter of Romans to the Roman people. She might have been the one that not only just read the scroll, this letter that we now know as letter to the Romans, but um, might have not spent time interpreting those teachings. So she was a teacher, she was a servant, and she was also a benefactor. So she was maybe a woman of wealth, and she financially supported the mission of the gospel through Paul in that place. So that's also important to remember too, is that this gospel work takes a whole group of people to fund it um, and to make it happen, to provide food, shelter, and um, aid for those in need and to get those, the good news out there. So may we today remember Phoebe, deacon in the church, proclaimer of the gospel, and in a benefactor to the early efforts of the apostles and of Paul. Have a good week. We'll see you next week.